Hello friends, this is teacher JB. Uh, today we are studying Yes, No Questions, part two. Yes, No Questions, part two. First, we have a question. Do you have small children? And then we need to answer with no. No. And then to you, no. I do not. No, I do not. Or if you want, you can contract this. No, I don't. So this is good enough. But if you want, you can continue. No, I do not have small children. Small children. Do you have a small children? No, I do not. Or no, I don't have small children. Number two, are there special stores for pet products? So you need to answer yes. Yes. And first one, it was two question. So you need to answer with two. And this is our question. You need to answer with the R. Yes, there are. Yes, there are. And this is good enough. And then you can make a long quest, a sentence, long answer. Yes, there are special stores for pets, for pet product. P-R-O, I'm sorry, pet products, D-U-C-T-S. And number three, is your apartment big? And answer is no. But at the same time, you need to answer with is. No, my apartment, P-A-R-T-M-E-N-T, -E is not big. No, my apartment is not big. Or you can say isn't big. But at the same time, if you want, is your apartment big, you can use pronoun no. It isn't. No, it isn't. And short answer. And you can say, no, it isn't. Big. Number four. Does she like cat? Yes. Yes. And does question. And you need to answer with does. Yes, she does. Yes, she does. And this is good enough. But if you want, yes. She likes. She likes cats. So this is a good answer. And but if you want, you still can answer this way. Are they are they friendly? So here, our question you need to answer with are saying no. They are not. No, they are not. And then if you want, you can you uh, add friendly. Okay, let's read those uh, questions and answer. Do you have small children? No, I don't. No, I don't have small children. Are there special stores for the uh, for pet product? Yes, there are. Or you can say, yes, there are a special store for pet product. I'm sorry, at uh, this sp stores, I missed S here. And number three, is your apartment big? No. My apartment is not big, or you can say, no, it isn't. No, it isn't big. Number four, does she like cats? Yes, she does, or yes, she like cats. And number five, are they friendly? No, they are not. No, they are not friendly. Number six, did you go shopping last night? So this is did question. You need to answer with did, yes. Simply, yes, I did. Yes, I did. But if you want to make a long question, uh, yes. I went shopping. Yes, I went shopping last night. But the better answer is, yes, I did. Number seven, does she have curly hair? No. And does question, does answer. 
No, she does not. No, she does not. Or you can contract this. No, she doesn't. No, she doesn't. Or no, she doesn't have curly hair. Number eight, are they new students? Our question and our answer. No, they are not. Or you can say, no, they aren't. No, they aren't. And then you can uh, add new students if you want. No, they are not. Or no, they are not new students. Number nine, are Dong and Nam your classmates? So no. And then our, our question, our answer, no. Let's use a pronoun. Uh, they, Dong and Nam, they are not, or they aren't. No, they are not. And then, my classmates, my classmates. Okay, number 10. Do your children speak English well? Yes. Do question, do answer. Yes. They do. Yes, they do. Or yes, they speak. Yes, they speak uh, English well. English well. Okay, uh, let, let's read the questions and uh, answers one more time. Did you go shopping last night? Yes, I did. Yes, I went shopping last night. Does she have curly hair? No, she doesn't. No, she doesn't have curly hair. Are they new students? No, they are not. No, they are not new students. Number nine, are Dong and Nam your classmates? No, they are not. Or no, they are not my classmates. Number 10, do your children speak English well? Yes, they do. Yes, they do not say yes, they are. Just say yes, they do. Or yes, they speak English well. Okay, friends, this is the conclusion of today's study. I will come back to you with another topic as soon as possible. Until then, keep studying English and have a great day. Bye.